am chasing satellites with a lot of antennas at my home. My rooftop is filled with a lot of antennas. rocket girl for the past 2 weeks i have been making and testing different antennas now i'll show you all the different antennas that i have this is the first one it's a quadrifilar helix antenna shortly called qfh antenna it is a circularly polarized antenna since weather satellites in low earth orbit transmit circularly polarized signals this is the best antenna to receive signals from them I have mounted my QFH antenna on this mast to support it against the winds and give it some altitude. This is another mast where I have mounted two antennas. One is the ground plane antenna and another is a Yagi antenna. The ground plane antenna is a vertically polarized antenna and can receive signals in full azimuth plane. The third antenna is a Yagi antenna. and it's horizontally polarized it can give more gain along the axis of the antenna unlike my tape antenna i'm not hand tracking it i've put it in a fixed position can you see one more antenna here this is my slim jim antenna and it is vertically polarized it is meant for terrestrial communication but i'm trying to receive signals from weather satellites all these four antennas are designed for vhf band specifically 137 megahertz to receive signals from low earth orbit weather satellites this is my fifth antenna it's a parabolic dish of 1.5 meter diameter and i'm using this antenna to receive signals from geostationary satellites in 1.7 gigahertz band helical antenna feed is attached for 1.7 gigahertz frequency i've tested all the antennas for receiving weather images In the upcoming videos I'll be talking about each of the antennas. How to know whether the antennas are designed properly? To check it I have bought Nano VNA. How to use it and check the antenna performance? 